open a browser and go to virtualbox.org click on downloads and choose the windows host link which will take you to the download link click on save and choose a directory where you want this to be copied it will get downloaded there depending on your internet speed it might take a while so that's the first tool we need there's also an extension pack which you may use so if you just scroll down there is an extension pack link click on that save that also into the same destination so that you have both those downloaded now we shall set up virtualbox click on the virtualbox.exe follow the default options and get the virtualbox software installed again it can take a while before the software gets completely installed just wait for it to complete and once it's ready it will open the prompt to say finish and opens up the virtualbox window in this go to the global tools tab and you have a default network available with the 56.1 subnet we will use this for our vm so that we don't necessarily need network access it will be a local host only network go to the preferences in the file menu choose a default destination where you want your virtual box related disks or files to be created i have chosen a particular path next we shall install the virtual box extension pack double click on that it will come up with a pop up to install don't worry about the upgrade option here and on the pop up click agree by scrolling down it will take a moment in which it will get the required software to be installed and you are done.